Hello everyone, this is Crota giving you an audio commentary between... Uh, what is going on here? How come I can't unpause this? There we go. I'm giving you an audio commentary between Middle Student and um, Sky. No, actually this... Okay, Middle Student is actually Sky. He's going by a different name in this tournament. Meanwhile, we also have Suho. So we have w, um, Pepsi, w Pepsi Suho versus WE Sky, I believe. I think those are the teams, I forget. So it's Sky versus Skuhos. Sky is spawning on the bottom right hand corner as the purple human player. Meanwhile, we have Suho spawning on the top left of Turtle Rock as the red Night Elf player. We do have an early militia scout in order to see if there is an Ancient of War creeping. So this is going to be a cross spawn. So the Ancient of War is going to go ahead and be completed. So Ancient of War is going to be completed. It is going to produce a single an archer grab the uh, creeps from over here and then have the demon hunter followed up to grab some experience as well we do have um what barracks farm being built in addition to altar of kings so nothing too out of the ordinary coming in from sky and we, now we have a peasant is going to be able to scout out suho so we do know that this is going to be a cross spawn and this particular goblin merchant shop should become should come in very handy especially with that scene war or that permanent site I'm coming in so that you could you can see the hidden night elf units, invisible units, and also just a good scouting for any incoming attack. A middle sc um, sky now going ahead and producing an archmage, and we do have a demon hunter from Suho. So very typical, um, very typical build so far. And um, it would have been interesting if sky. If the, he if Sky went ahead and produced a farm over here to the bottom, and if he produced it, I think he may have been able to trap the Demon Hunter and and a trapped Demon Hunter that early in the game would have been a little bit funny, I think. Anyways, we do have an Archmage coming out, and we have a single Footman coming out, Wisp now coming out as well. So we are going to see some creeping going on. Archer it did draw the aggro, and the Ancient of War is taking a lot of damage right now. Demon Hunter is going to go ahead and pop on out, and then take um, take on the Giant Sea Turtle. Let's see, uh, he, Demon Hunter does get the last hit on the Giant Sea Turtle, so no real worries there. Meanwhile, we have the Archmage creeping, Militia creeping against the Giant Sea Turtle over here to the, um, over here outside his base. So Sky is going to go ahead and get halfway to level 2 as well, picks up a Cloak of Shadows. Now, Sky wants to go ahead and head across the map, grab this t creep spawn as well, making sure that he is not anywhere too close to Suho, not quite sure what he's going to do. Scout farm is in place. Suho is regenerating his Ancient of War, and we have Archmage going ahead trying to take down this giant sea turtle. So both players are playing pretty conservatively right now. No early harass, t trying to get to level 2 relatively quickly. Demon Hunter should get to level 2 after this creep camp. And no, he is not going to uh, not going to finish off that creep camp. So Let's see what's going to happen here. Do we have no militia coming in across the map? So there is not going to be any... Oh no, I spoke too soon. Militia coming in across the map. So we are going to have a fast expansion attempt coming in from Sky. This particular creep camp, if you have defend, is a very, very easy creep camp to pull pull off as there is a lot of normal armor. Let's see what's going to happen here. Drops. Is he going to drop? Yes, drops of water elemental. Going after those troll berserkers as they, are, as they go down really, really quickly to focus fire of footmen. Demon Hunter is going to join in on the mix now. So... Oh, Tome of Agility plus two, and we have an Immolation coming in from the Demon Hunter. So Demon Hunter, um, and using Immolation, trying to take down a lot of those units, and the Troll Warlord is going to go down. It gets a Flute of Accuracy. Is the Demon Hunter going to pick it up? No, the Archmage has gets the True Shot Aura, gets a Surround on the Demon Hunter, but surrounding a Demon Hunter with Immolation, I don't know uh, how useful that really is. And... Demon Hunter is going to go ahead and teleport out. A couple of militias um, were dropped. L Arcane Vault now being produced. And um, yeah, so Sky doing a really, really good job. Is going to get to level three on this uh, on this particular creep camp. And it has two cloaks of shadows. Going to sell one of those m more than likely. And we have um, Sky currently sitting at 32 over 36. Meanwhile, um, Suo, um, I believe it's Suo. Don't know how to pronounce his name that well. Haven't seen him too often. And is at 30 over 40. <coughs> Demon Hunter now coming in across the map does not have a scroll of town portal does have a lot of archers in play So no defend it's gonna be quite interesting to see how this works Water elemental currently in play a mana burn on the de on the um, Archmage Archmage no longer able to drop down a quick water elemental right now And there is a hidden archer in the mix arcane tower being produced five 
or six peasants still sticking around. So those peasants are going to be able to, to bring up that town hall. And going to get another mana burn off. Yeah, another mana burn was and did get off. And now Archmage is getting focused down by those archers. Should probably try to focus down the archers more than focus on the demon hunter. The demon hunter is a little bit faster. It does have more armor with that um, slippers of agility and the ring of protection. So really, really hard fight for that demon or for that archmage. Archmage now running. Um, I think he's running to the goblin merchant shop to pick up a perhaps a, a, a boots of speed. Meanwhile, demon hunter now trying to run back. Both players just trying to get into position. And Sky or Suho already at Tree of Ages. Do not see double ancient of lore tech yet. A little bit behind on wood. And let's see. D Archmage is currently sitting there, waiting, not doing much. We do have Art Demon Hunter and Archers just coming around, and let's let's can see what's going to happen here. Town Hall is now nearing completion. Um, let's see, not enough wood for middle for Sky, so Sky's not able to speed build that anymore. And we Naga Sea Witch in play? No, Pandarian Brewmaster in play. So we have Pandarian Brewmaster and Demon Hunter currently in play, making a, a making a run for the main base. The main base is very empty right now, so this is going to be pretty bad. We do have an Ancient of Wonders being dropped in the middle of the map right now. We have a Dust of Appearance and a, a, a Boots of Speed being purchased as well. So let's see if um, Sky is going to go. Yeah, Sky is going to go ahead and try to take down these and dual Ancient of Winds in play in the middle of the map. Um, so Ancient of Winds, no Ancient of Lores. Um, going to be a little interesting to try to see how this really works out. Archmage does not have enough for any additional water elementals, and this water elemental is going to go down. Meanwhile, we have um, um, archers and Pandir and Brewmaster now trying to fight off, trying to get into the back of the base right now. Ar or Guard Tower now being produced so to try to um, hold off this attack a little bit more. Sky does have the economic advantage, but the tech advantage and the hero advantage would go to um, Suho at this time. Pandir and Brewmaster doing Breath of Fire, raining fire all over, the, or breathing fire all over those footmen going to you know really wear down those um uh, wear down those footmen un until we can just focus down with those archers look at that three three very very low hit point footmen and the archers would could can play hide hide and go seek with him um, hide and then be able to just focus uh, focus off units left and right so now down goes one footman another footman may go down and uh, no, it doesn't look like any footmen are going to go down anymore. Ancient of Wonders, and we have Druids of the Talon in play. If those Druids of the Talon turn around, they'll be able to, no, not going to turn around. Not going to pick off those footmen over there. So footmen now trying to run away from that Pandirian Brewmaster. Got off, I think, one or two kills on a footman. So Archmage currently sitting back, using a Clarity Potion, trying to get some additional mana. Trying, this guy's just really trying to um, regroup himself, recover himself. Suho's currently sitting at a 42 over 50. While um, Sky is sitting at 46 over 48, but remember, most of that population count is coming from um, peasants. So a lot, a lot of peasants in play. So the army really is not as large, and while uh, the footman loses half of his life just trying to run and meet up with his friends, how painful! Archmage and Watermental now trying to come back in, and we may have a two-pronged attack trying to push in on both sides. Pandirian Brewmaster getting hit by Arcane Tower, and a little bit of a misplay from Suho, mi losing one or perhaps even two um, Breath of Fires. The Breath of Fires really what is hurting hurting these footmen. Footmen now um, trying to come in from the back. Militia not coming in from the back. Oh, oh Suho is going to get caught in a really, really bad position if he's not careful. Trying to get, trying to. Um, Take down the Pandarian Brewmaster archers, um, low hit point archers in play, low hit point footmen in play. Both players just um, doing a good job of just trying to uh, micro right now, but those footmen are just running in, running to the back, getting focused down. A lot of fairy fire as well. So fairy fire, those um, minus four armor e equates to um, about uh, what was that negative twenty four percent of their. Uh, losing 24% of their life, so those footmen are going to go down really, really quickly. Stay tuned for part two of this replay between Suho and Sky here on Turtle Rock.